hello guys welcome to my kitchen my name is Adetong. today i am making a bacha also known as african salad first we are going to put some hot water over the abacha and this is to soften it abacha is also known as cassava flakes make sure the water covers it leave it for two to three minutes now i left my own for five minutes because i was you know doing other things but it was soft enough now i am making the marinade for my fish i am using mackerel or titus fish and that was onions pepper bell pepper garlic ginger this is rosemary i'm going to put thyme and also parsley now the full list of ingredients will be displayed in the description box below now i will be grilling the fish as you will see shortly however you can use any type of fish you like you can fry you can grill anything that tickles your fancy is good and fine so i am using my mini chopper to chop the vegetables and the herbs together and which i would apply to the fish shortly Please remember to grease the foil or uh, spread with some oil before placing the fish and adding your marinade. I forgot and when I remembered you would see me, I quickly removed the fish to spray it. This is to ensure that the fish doesn't stick to the foil, you know, and it makes it easy for you to remove when it's time. I just removed the fins. The fish was already gutted, like they removed all the guts and the intestines. So I just had to put some incisions, which would make it easier for the marinade to sink into it, to go into it and make it flavorful and tasty. Rub the marinade on each side. Make sure you put it in between the incisions, put it in the belly, put it everywhere. So this was where I remember to spray the foil to spray the foil and then spray the fish i had already preheated my oven to 375 degrees and i grilled for 20 minutes while the fish is sitting pretty and grilling we are going back to abacha i'll be using an alternative to corn also known as potash which is baking soda you mix it with water so that you can cuddle the palm oil now that's a huru with the shell. This is without the shell and I am using the one that's already blended. Ensure you are mixing as you pour in the liquid baking soda. Please note that the baking soda doesn't dissolve easily. So just go ahead, turn it and keep turning. You can see that it has finally coddled. I have started to add the remaining ingredients, uba, pepper, but more also known as cow skin some cameroon pepper seasoning garden egg crayfish the whole nine yards so add everything and make sure you mix it well to make sure that it is well incorporated lastly you add your abacha and you add in bits and keep stirring to make sure that every strand of the cassava flake is covered with the uncha sauce once you are done mixing, you can serve it with onions, we can serve it with garden egg, with some, I served it with some peppered shrimp and pomo and the fish, anything that tickles your fancy. If you have some palm wine, perfect. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. See you in my next video. Bye.